Oh, we got this cute little title screen here. I play on PS4. Oh, nice. I mean, either tanks or healers. Same here, Goldie. I play mostly D.Va, Hanzo, Genji, basically any sniper and Mercy. I like playing... I like playing D.Va. I also like playing... Oh god, what was his name? Uh, Roadhog. I like playing Roadhog. And then Sombra, Lucio. Also, this is really cute. Nico. Yeah, Roadhog is fun, but OP. Yeah, his self-healing is really <laughs> something, isn't it? Elio, are you still there? It look This looks like Gin, but with a purple cake and scarf instead of brown orange. Oh my god. I want to see like a little edit of <laughs> Nico as Gin now. <laughs> that sounds so cute. Your voice is so cute. Ah, thank you, Wonder XP. <laughs> Let me see. Yes, I am still here. Ah. Huh. I'm awake. I had a dream just now. I saw. You did? Wow. I... I really thought I was back home. Oh, I'm sorry, baby. You're still in this world. We'll, we'll get you out of here. Oh, the sun back in my home world isn't a light bulb. It's a big ball of fire in the sky. Holy moly, great balls of fire. Kalia's great. Oh, thank you, Ian. Love that dude. I'll be lurking, but I'm here. I'm happy to have you here again. I don't think I would be able to hold it like I do with the sun from your world. This isn't my world. Wait, is that how you pronounce your name? I thought it was like Elo. You can pronounce it either Elio or Elo. I tend to go with like Elio since that seems to be the pronunciation most people go with for me. So ye. Ah yes, one shot. Another game that broke my heart multiple times. <laughs> I'm ready to have my heart broken. Huh? This isn't the world I live in. Really? Yeah, my son also isn't a light bulb. Uh, I guess not. If you're the god of this world, you wouldn't necessarily be in it. What's your homeworld called? Earth. I see you put the white hairspray on again. Yes. Well, I'm not gonna be mean. L let me just tell Nico about Earth. Earth? Like, the stuff on the ground? Wait, do you live underground? No. <laughs> ah, neither do we. But shrews and field mice and stuff do. Does your world have a sun? Yes, it does. Yes, it's also a ball of fire. Why Why would I withhold information from Nico? Nico is adorable. Really? Wow. Can you hold it? Nope. That was a silly question, wasn't it? The sun in my home world is very bright. Also, thank you for the follow, Wonder XP. I appreciate it a lot. Warm, too. You saw, right? I... We're not gonna meet him anytime soon, but I will just... Oh? Is there... Is there an attractive character that is gonna show up, Goldie? We already met Silver, and Silver is very attractive. But it goes away sometimes at night. Everything gets dark, kinda like how this world is now. But it's okay because the sun always comes back the next day. That's good, don't you think? Anyone who follows Elio gets my love. Oh, <laughs> thank you, Yen. No problem, you're so sweet. Oh my god. Oh, no, you're, you're the sweet one, Wonder XP. You're the sweet one. Thank you. Let me see. My world is like that, too. Ah. Uh, do you sleep during the night? No. <laughs> no, I'm a night owl. <laughs> we go to sleep usually. But some people stay up and use computers. Oh my god, he's calling me out. I don't have to explain what they are, do I? There's a bunch of them in this world. Oh, hello there, Jackie. Welcome to the stream. How have your day? I am stumbling over my words. How has your day been? 
Uh, anyway, we should probably get going. Alright, yeah, let's go. So, where was I supposed to go? Travel... I think I was going... to the outpost? Okay, so hello. Do you have anything else to say? Hello again. Are there more questions you wish to ask? Let me see. I don't think anything new has been added, so let's just get out of there. Is there anything... Oh, yeah. Yeah, there is some... I never did go in here, did I? A robot without power. It won't turn on. What's this note? The use of a robot as a replacement... Oh, wait. Maybe I have, but I don't remember seeing... This light thingy over here, so... Self-charger, solar battery model, N87. One year warranty included. Simply place your self-charging battery in full daylight with the lens facing up. Huh. Convenient. Charges in seconds. No external power is needed. This bee reminded me of Boktai. Charge with the sun. Troubleshooting manual. If the battery fails to charge, check to see if the lens on the front side has not been dislodged during transport. One charge cycle will last about 10 days. Oh, I can use my lens here. If you notice a decline in the charge cycle within the warranty period, please contact the manufacturer. This box looks interesting. I wish I had something to pry it open with. Well, I do, actually, Nico. So let's pry it open. This bar should do open it. There's a little metal cube and some broken glass in here. Looks like what used to be a machine part. It says solar battery on the side. Huh. It's empty now. Still got some shards of glass at the bottom though. Let me see. Let me see, can I use... Hmm. I thought I used that. Oh wait, no. I'm not gonna smash the sun. Oh wait, no, I didn't mean to do that. I'm sorry, Nico. <laughs> can I put this in here? Uh, let's see. One, a robot may not injure a living person or, through inaction, allow a person to come to harm. Hmm. Two. A robot must obey the orders given to it by people, except where such orders would conflict with the first law. 3. A robot must protect its own existence, as long as such protection does not conflict with the first or second law. Huh. Okay. What is this? So we got a map of the world. So I think we're- we've- it's just been purple all around, so we're just in the barrens right now. Looks like there's like a town in the middle? Okay. Hmm. Can I use the lens? No, no, no. I didn't mean to combine the light bulb with the lens. Lens with the broken battery. I may or may not have left a game name. Ooh, I will check it out then. <laughs> the lens pops right in. Okay, so now we have an empty battery. Can I combine this with this? Where... Using the sun directly on the battery? I would have never thought of that. Good thinking, Elio. Ah, it looks like it's already fully charged. That was fast. Okay, so we got a charged battery. Can we... What do we use that for? Wait, where? Where am I at? Oh. These shelves. A page with faded ink. Able to provide power to all robots and machinery in the area via a large electromagnetic field. Maintenance efforts are quite high, as expected. We have provided customized backup cells for the few most important robots. Their electromagnetic fields are much weaker, and the signals are highly specific. Ooh, Among Us would be really fun. Oh yeah, I actually have Among Us! 
So maybe we can all play together sometime. I have it on Steam. In other words, these small cells can only charge one single... The rest of the page is unreadable. Huh. Alright. Is that some more shrimps? There are a lot of small, growing, glowing shrimp swimming in the jar. I like how shrimp are like a light source in this game. Ah, I'm buying it this week, so that would be fun. Ooh, nice. I will try and fit in a little community stream with it then. It's a power cell, I think. Oh, the word profit bot is written on the side. Didn't notice that earlier. I want it on Steam. I got it on phone. Sad noises. Aw. Sorry about that, Joe. I don't really get a whole lot of apps on my phone because my phone is really old. Like, I have to uninstall everything for me to be able to play Identity V. <laughs> That's a big machine. Doesn't seem to be doing anything, though. There's a rectangle-shaped hole in the middle. Looks like something used to fit in there. Well... Is it perhaps this charged battery? It is square. Let's hope the charged battery does something. I play Identity V. Oh, you posted another suggestion yet? Also, who is your main Wonder XP? I main Andrew. <laughs> I only play Andrew or Joseph. Because I'll be simping. Whoa! Well, if Yen leaves... A suggestion I will have to play it. I'll do anything for the yen. Oh, hey. You guys are up and running now. Tracy, mechanic. Oh, isn't it her birthday today? Tracy is very cute. I am functional. I can walk. I see. I am functional. Did you power the generator? Oh, Eeb, huh? Didn't Elio play Eeb already? I have, but it's been a couple of years since I've played Eeb. I played it when the update came out that end, that added like a an endgame dungeon or whatever. I forget how many years ago that was. But I haven't played it in a while, so I might be coming into it blind. Oh, there's more to that suggestion. Ooh. I'm curious. Let, let me pull up my let me pull up my Twitch page because I'm in the Twitch monitor right now. Let me see what your suggestion says, Yen. Let me scroll down. I gotta see this. Eve, have you done Eve? I'd love to go through it with you too. Ooh, yes, yes, let's go through Eve together. Hell yeah. I'm down for that. Heck yeah. Did you power the generator? I'll be Gary. Nice. I'll be Mary. I love Mary. Mary. I, I used to RP Mary on Tumblr. She's my baby. <laughs> did you power the generator? I guess we did. Right, Elio? I freaking love Mary. I know, I know a lot of people don't like Mary because of the things that she does in that game, but man, I really like her. <laughs> Okay, so... Wait, 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 wait. So let's see. I can use the computer. I see you've made progress in this world, Elio. But that progress stops here. Oh. What? I believe you need a code to unlock a certain box. Well, the code no longer exists in this world. Oh, do I- Do you understand what this means, Elio? A, a text box just popped up to me. But I don't think you guys can see it. You know what this means, Elio? Uh, no, I don't know <laughs> what that means. You still don't know the extent of the world's deterioration, do you, Elio? Ah, oh, he also plays Luca. Ooh, Luca is really good. <laughs> I, I don't have Luca. I would like to get Luca at some point. He looks fun. <sighs> Most of the time, stray pieces of this world would be lost to blissful nothingness. Oh yeah, 
yeah, this game does a lot of stuff like that, like going into the game files and stuff. Nice. Yeah, I, I noticed it pulled the name that was my laptop and I had to change it because it was calling me by my kin name. <laughs> but this code, this document, is an exception. I was able to salvage it because Nico needs the code to progress. Now, I'll go find it. What does that mean? Wait. Is it maybe I gotta go in my files? Is that what it's saying? Is it like Doki Doki where I gotta go in my files? Let me see. See a readme. Let me check that. Synopsis, features, default. Some features. I'll see in reviews. It did documents after all. Yeah. Let me see. Do I have to renew my folder? Credits, graphics, soundtrack, do, do, do. Maybe it put it in my documents? Let me see. I have a lot of shit in my documents though. Hopefully not. I don't see anything in my files, so. Huh. see. Oh, wait. Is it here? No. Oh, wait. Let me go to my PC documents. PC documents. Do oh, document dot one shot. Okay. It's in my PC documents, not in the game folder. Oh, God. Dear, d -d 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 -d. hold on. Let me let me try and show this real fast. Properties, document. So yeah, here's the document that I pulled up on my PC. Give me one second to change the resolution. Dear, d -d 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 -d. I one d -d -d do. Message to you, and I'm afraid I must be brief. I have left you a journal, part of which is written in a language that. <laughs> Read it, and you will know what to do. I have also left you a mask, <laughs> which you. Look for a metal safe in the quarry to the east, somewhere between the ocean and the lookout point. The code you need is 294770. Alright. 294770. Gotcha. Alright. Let's go back into the game then. I gotta go to the quarry. It did documents after all. I actually don't remember what to do here. Sorry. It's all good, Goldie. Okay. So then. Do, do, do. Aw. <laughs> okay. So. Said it was at the basin, right? Oh wait, maybe. Okay. Let me go back to the cliffs. Where were the cliffs actually? It was somewhere near here, right? I think. There was like a safe. Yeah, there was a safe around here, wasn't there? That the one we got open? Hello, LGBTQ community. Hello, Gunman Tanaka. How are you doing? <laughs> I think I just called you Gundam Tanaka, but your name is Cactus, but wh whatever. You're, you're married to Gundam Tanaka. That's, that's all I really know. Gundam? <laughs> I am. Oh, so you are Gundam Tanaka. Let's see. Where is that safe? Is it? Oh, it's right around here. No, I am Gundam Tanaka. <laughs> I am Gundam Tanaka and I'm married to him. Nice. Self love. I can respect that. Mel safe. I do. Okay, let me look at my 
folder. So it's 294770. Whoa, it worked! Yeah, baby! The power of looking in your do computer documents. Oh, thank you for the hydrate. Let me have some of my green tea then. So might not chat much for a bit, doing some stuff. It's all good. Good luck with whatever you're doing. I am the IRL Kaede Ga. Oh, we got some Duncan Rumpa kinnies in chat. Hello. <laughs> well, it worked. Wait, how did you know the code, Elio? I looked in my documents folder. I still don't remember seeing one. Well, I had some help. I have my ways. If I say that, I think he'll be like, Wow, you're so cool, Elio. And I like when people call me cool. I see. What's in the safe, Nico? Oh, right. Let's see. Ah, I found a gas mask. Has anyone done like a Hello Charlotte and One Shot crossover? Because this game kind of reminds me of Hello Charlotte in a lot of ways. Especially since I'm playing as like an overseer. Also, there's this weird looking book. I can't read it though. Not that I can't read or anything, because I can. I just don't know what language this is. Oh, maybe, maybe I can read it? Oh shit, what? I got a glitch. What is that? I don't know, I can't reach it. Let me see, can I read it? Found of the Barons, it's written in unknown language. Huh. Okay. Well, we have a gas mask, so we can travel to that one area that was, uh, poisoned or whatever. So, let's go back to the gas area. So now we can explore that. Let's see, is it this way? Sorry, me. Arms itching. Yep, this is it. Oh my god, Nico with a gas mask looks really funny. <laughs> I should be fine with this mask on. Oh, I like the music. It's a gas vent. Thing is, you have a lot coming at the Among Us stream because when I'm the detective, well, I, I can be a pretty nasty detective too. I'll, I'll, I'll do lies. If, if it gets me far, if it gets me to like find out who is the killer, I'll lie. I, I won't, I won't care. If it gets me to my destination, I'll lie. I've, I've done that in, in real life. We did like a mafia thing. I think I already said it on stream before. But we did a mafia thing, IRL, and I was like, uh, the person that was next to me, either one or two spaces away, raised their hand. So they're mafia. But I just made a guess. I just made a guess on who the, the fucking Mafia members were. And then they started fighting amongst themselves, trying to pin blame on one another. So I was like, okay, it's definitely one of them. If one of them is pushing blame on them. So I just kept pushing on this one person. And just kept lying about how I could, like, see stuff or, like, how their the fucking words are and all that. And then I got them killed and they were Mafia. I feel like the Among Us stream is going to be the end of a lot of friendships. <laughs> I'll call a bluff as a crewmate so I don't get falsely voted. Oh, I'm about to go eat soon, so I'll continue me lurk. Alrighty, see you later, Roselet. Or, welcome back. I don't know if you came back or... I don't know. Sorry. I'm not a smart imposter. I'm better as a crewmate. I'm... I can be kind of stupid at being an imposter. I, I'm still not used to killing people. I've only got an imposter once while playing Among Us, so I'm not used to the whole kill mechanic in that game yet. It's a pair of rubber gloves. They're a bit heavy. I'm not sure when I'll do an Among Us stream. I know I want to do... There's like a couple of community streams I want to do. Next week, I'm going to be doing Dicey Dungeons, which is a single-player game. But... 
I want to do a Jackbox party pack game with everyone. I want to do 100% orange juice with everyone. Especially because Okami was talking to me about doing a giveaway for Steam copies of that for anyone that doesn't have it. And then Among Us, of course. It's a big metal box, complicated machinery inside. 100% uh, orange juice. It's like a Mario Party kind of game, but with like anime characters. It's really fun. It's a big metal box with complicated machinery inside. Hello, person. The robot assembly and repair services have been discontinued at the Barrens. If you have further inquiry, please contact the head engineer. The funny thing is, Yen, I got imposter like my first game of playing Among Us. And then I was like, wait, how do I kill people? And then people voted me out before I could even learn how to kill someone because I was sticking close to the killer. And then they fucking were like, oh, it was Elio. And I was like, okay, I know I'm an imposter, but you're an imposter too, dude. Stick stick up for your fellow imposter, man. <laughs> but yeah, that, that was one heck of an intro to the game. If you have further inquiry, please contact the head engineer. It's a big metal box, complicated machinery inside. This seems to be a page ripped out of a book. Cannot overstate the importance of cleaning solvents in this environment. Here's a simple recipe using the alternative method discussed in the last chapter, utilizing the natural properties of blue phosphor. Reagents, acidic gas, blue phosphor, rare form. Instructions, in a well-ventilated area, direct the gas into your container of choice. Seal immediately. That's the end of the page. So long, gay Bowser. I mean, can't you change your name in Among Us? Or can you only set your name once you start playing? <laughs> Played Among Us once, got an imposter, and freaking wiped out the entire crew because no one thought I knew how to play. Oh my god. <laughs> I, I do that a lot when I play Town of Salem. I, I pretend that I don't know how to play the game. So I'm like, uh, the reason I didn't talk is because I don't know how to play the game, guys. And I'm like, <laughs> time to kill all of you. It's a big metal box, complicated machinery inside. It's like the easiest way to get people to not suspect you if you're an imposter or whatever, like your mafia. Just pretend you don't know how to play the game. <laughs> the door is all boarded up. The boards seem loose though. I should be able to pull them off with the right tool. Well, have I got the thing for that? Good thing I kept this crowbar. What a workout. I never do that. I will fake detective as imposter, but slip up somewhere and get voted. I literally just watched a whole bunch of videos, so I know how to play. But since everyone thought I never even heard this game, they didn't suspect me. <laughs> nice. Yeah, Among Us got really popular all of a sudden, despite it being out for like years now. I'm, I'm curious why it got so popular all of a sudden. <laughs> A bunch of robots without power. Like, I know it was popular back in the day, but it's like suddenly really surging in popularity. It's so weird. <laughs> I guess the generator can only do so much. Bunch of robots without power. Okay, is there anything in here? This robot looks kind of rusty. It's a big metal box with complicated machinery. There seems to be a page ripped out of a book. Two. Without breaking the seal, inject the liquid phosphor into a container. Shake vigorously to initiate the reaction. Use as soon as possible. No. If elements begin to separate, further shaking is required. Yeah, I think it was because the Henry Stickman collection came out on Steam. It's the same creators as Among Us. Oh, I see. Also, no. Hand projection is critical after this step. The resulting acid is moderately stronger than common household cleaners. Oh boy, this makes me nervous. I don't know what half of these words mean. It's a good thing you're here, Elio. 
I, are you sure you should trust in me, Nico? I'm kind of a dumbass. This robot looks kind of rusty. A cleaning sponge with a rough surface. I still can't get over the 999 stream where, where Barn was just like up front on confirming that I'm a dumbass. Like, God. Cleaning sponge with a rough surface. This robot looks kind of rusty. Bunch of robots. Okay, I think that is everything here. Barn is the brutally honest friend. <laughs> I hate it. It's a big metal box. All right, hello? Did I talk to you? Hello, person. The robot assembly and repair services have been discontinued at the Barrens. If you have further inquiry, please contact the head engineer. Seems to be a paid, did I read this? Cannot overstate the, yeah, I think, yeah, I already read that. Okay. All right, let's go over here. What does explore? Oh, there's a note over here. What does that say? There's something weird about the robots who get sent to work near the gas fields. They appear to accumulate rust at a much slower rate than others. Huh. Huh. Wonder why. The few who work directly with gas harvesting look practically new. Is that a result of the atmosphere, or am I just seeing things? Oh shit. I... Okay. Let's see, what's over here? Oh, there's like, oh, that's a big boy. Oh, hello. What are you doing here? Hmm? A living person such as yourself should have evacuated this place long ago. Oh, but I just got here. To this world, I mean. See, I have the sun. Oh, the Messiah. I do not know what to say. Reading you was not part of my programming. Have you spoken to ProfitBot? Yes, I have. I think so, yeah. ProfitBot was built with the sole purpose of greeting you. Really? Yes, he cannot speak with anyone else. At least not with these. Oh, that's... Kind of sad. What are you built for then? My purpose is to guard this settlement. Even though the residents have long gone, I must remain. Huh. Why though? I have not been tamed. Yeah, everyone's not being tamed. What's up with taming robots? You guys aren't animals. Tamed? It was not worth the effort. Huh. You have anything else to say, bro? By the way, some robots may start following you around this settlement as well. Do not be alarmed. It is their job to keep people safe. Stay safe. Okay. Oh, hi. Unit RM2883417 reporting for duty. I saw that you spoke with, with the guardian of the settlement. I will now escort you until you reach your dormitory. Um, what? Let's see, what is this? It's a power cell. I think. It's a powerhouse. There's writing on this one too. It says, Guardian of Residential Area. Huh. So that's their life force for that big boy outside. It's looking a little dim. Looks like they're evacuating the few teamed robots we have here. Makes sense. No point in keeping them in the barrens if all the people are already gone. I wonder if the engineer is going to... Apparently, phase one of the evacuation ended prematurely. The big ship started malfunctioning only after a few round trips. 
He said it was due to something with squares. Is that the glitches? I'm not sure what they mean by that. Bummer. Looks like they won't be able to transport most of these surplus bots to the city at this rate. And we worked so hard on those. But I suppose the robots are busy enough with transporting people as is. I think it's gonna be our turn soon. Huh. It's a long... A long ladder. <laughs> I almost said staircase. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm dumb. Sorry. I'm scared of ladders. I'm scared of heights too, Nico. I know that feeling. Okay, we, we won't go up then, baby. It's okay. We, we don't need to go. Okay, is this another new little bed area? Some of the ink on this page is faded. Likely do some sort of electrical or magnetic interference. I'm afraid this operation can no longer be sustained. If the servers continue to fail so much, that maintenance cannot keep up the pace. Fortunately, it does not seem to be happening to the robots, at least not at a significant rate. Time will tell. Yeah, I remember going to Anime Expo and the elevator at Anime Expo was like completely like see-through like a window elevator, so as I was going up, I could see outside and it scared me so freaking much. I hated using that elevator. I had to go up because my cousin can't walk upstairs because of her back problems and stuff, and I was with her, but every time I got in there, I would just close my eyes because it, it scared me so much. Checking, checking. Terminal does not respond. This is a problem. Yes, dear mama? I'm pretty sure these are computers now. All of these terminals do not boot. I am not sure what to do now. Huh. Okay, so that's one of these little rooms. Are there other rooms? It's a long corridor. Kind of like one of those houses in like ancient Greece, like the big arenas with like the open windows and stuff. A picture of a robot. You know, I've never been around so many robots before, Elio. Or any robots at all. I mean, I see them at, I see them at Walmart. I mean, I see them in cartoons and stuff, but I've never seen one in person. They're pretty neat, don't you think? Yeah. Hey, Nico, do a robot voice. <laughs> what? Try talking like a robot. Um. Ahem. Beep boop. I'm a robot, and I eat batteries instead of normal people food. <laughs> oh, got four hydrations from Joe. Let me have some of my green tea then. Thank you, Joe. It was good. I wish I added tea. I what? I wish I added some sugar to this tea, though. <laughs> that is not correct. Oh, we're being called out. Robots do not consume batteries in the same way people consume food. I'm gonna save up for 100 hydrates, 10 at different times. Oh boy, Joe. The power that that... The, I'm scared. I'm gonna have to like grab like five water bottles. That's gonna kill me. Robots do not... Okay, I read that. In fact, robots do not possess digestive systems. Suffer. Wow, Joe, thanks. I love you too, Joe. Some robots do not even have mouths. Elio. Try not to try not to spam all 100 at once though. Elio, you made me look silly. Well, it was you you looked cute, Nico. It wasn't silly. It was cute. You're a very good boy. Hello. 
Hi. What are you doing up there? I am stationed here. By yourself? Yes. Can I say anything else to you? Okay. Nope. Well, hang in there, bro. Good luck with whatever you're doing up there. Let me see if there are any other... Oh, there's like a little cross thingy here. Oh, infirmary. Okay. Oh, wait. There's a little ro robot out here. Let me talk to you. Hello, organic person who is alive. The infirmary is up ahead. Seems that you already have an assigned escort unit. Would you like me to leave? You can follow me if you want. Understood. I will now escort you until you reach your dormitory. Okay, but you're not gonna follow me into buildings and then you leave once I enter in a building, so... Hello, person of organic makeup. Welcome to the infirmary. Scanning for injuries. Um, scan complete. Injuries detected. None. You say that, but I have a bunch of emotional injuries, robot. Can you heal those? Treatment required? None. You are good to go. Er, uh, thanks? All right. It's a box of medical tools. Most of them are broken or arrested beyond use, but this plastic syringe seems to be okay. Ooh, a syringe, you say? Hello, person. Are you seeking admission into the infirmary? No. Oh, carry on then. I will carry on. Mikan? <laughs> I have tried out for Mikan before for like fan dubs and stuff. Let me let me see if I can do like a Let me see if I can do like a little Mikan voice. I just want to try it out. Let me Let me try and get into character. M my name is Mikan Simiki. Um um, if it's not too much trouble for you, I would like to be your friend. Would that be alright? There you go. <laughs> I don't know if that was a good Mekon or not, but... <laughs> That's my Mekon. Yes, I stand. <laughs> I've been trying out for some Ropa stuff. Hopefully I get that. Insert Hiyoko voice. Man, you're so ugly, Mikan. God, you pig. Here's my Hiyoko voice. Hey, sweetie. Six more weeks until you can come home. About time, huh? Gosh, I can't imagine living in that awful capsule wall. Dorm thing? But guess what? Soon you'll be able to sleep in a real bed and eat real food again. Right back soon. Love, Mom. Super high school level voice actor. <laughs> Thank you, Cactus. That makes me really happy. I want to be a voice actor someday. I stand Hiyoko, Kaere, Himiko, and Ibuki. Oh, I've actually voiced over Ibuki in a project before. But it's never come to fruition, so... I'm also, I also got cast as Pekko in a thing. But that's that project has also been... On hiatus for a while now, too. <laughs> right back soon. Love, Mom. Pekko. Pekko is one of my favorite girls, so that made me really happy. I got cast for her twice, but book projects never went anywhere. Aww. I'm trying out for some Danganronpa stuff right now, and I hope those can... If I get cast, that is. I hope they go somewhere. <laughs> Looks like we're supposed to pack stuff for the v the, for the for the, the, the for the evacuation starting today. I wish these books weren't so heavy. It's gonna be a pain to carry them onto a ship. But they're by the author. I can't just throw them away. Is there anyone up here? Nope. Okay. Well, I, w I won't force you to go up there, Nico. Is it ladders that you're scared of, or is it... 
Is it heights? Oh, you're just swallowing after me. Gotcha. Well, I didn't mean to do that. I meant to examine the note. Evacuation? At such short notice? I can't believe this. First the sun dies, now I'm out of a job. Some sort of mechanical drawing. Yeah, the, the project that I just recently tried out for, I tried out for a bunch of characters. I tried out for Aoi, um, Junko, Chiaki, uh, uh, what, what was her name? The photographer girl, I forgot her name already. Kotoko, Inagisa, and Komaru, so hope- Oh, also Chihiro. I tried out for Chihiro too. Hopefully I get one part from that. Mahiru, Mahiru, that's who I tried out for. Wow, I can't believe I didn't remember her name. She's Hiyoko's girlfriend. A robot, it's beyond repair. I was thinking of trying out for Mikan, but the, the people that already auditioned were really, really good, so I didn't feel like doing it. <laughs> I like listen to auditions before I try out. And I was like, oh, th these guys are too good. I, I can't, I can't compete. Oh wait, did I see all of the houses over here? Yoko X Mahiru is my OTP. It's a very good ship. That is completely valid of you, Joe. I really like for Danganronpa 2. My OTP is probably an OT3. I really like uh, Chiaki uh, and Komaida and Hinata all like together. Do not separate any of them. Okay, have I been in every house here? I gotta ship them hardcore. <laughs> have I been in this one? I think I might have. Kaede X Maki is my OTP. I have yet to play V3. I hope I can play it sometime soon. Let me see. Just wanna make sure I've been in every house. Chucky Komaida Hinata OT3 writes, thank you. <laughs> yes, do not separate them. God, I love it here. Oh, I'm, I'm glad you're liking it here, Wonder XP. I am happy to have you here. All right, so let's see. I think that should be it, right? See, can I? Oh, wait, 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 wait. 36 sips. This is harder than it seems. Oh boy. Fear. Fear. Wait. Can I use my syringe? No, no. Keep forgetting that. Can I? No. I cannot use it on this. Okay. Okay. Well then. Oh, can I get it from here? No. Okay. Well then. Let's just keep going then. Man, Nico with a gas mask is so funny. It even turns Nico's eyes like blue. This fan is on the ground. All the others are taller than me. Initially, the amount of noxious fumes emitted by the natural gas vents caught our team off guard. Uh, thank goodness the medical team reacted as quickly as they did. Despite its failure, that first expedition did bring up some interesting observations about the barrens. We found that there's not one but two such vent zones. With fumes being pumped out at such high concentrations, it seems a miracle that the gas hasn't spread anywhere else. Okay. 
A biologist concluded that the phosphor shrimp in the crater pools were actively consuming the gas. The shrimp in the ocean also prevent the gas from wafting off into the glen. If that's the case, then we owe a lot to these little guys. Oh, can I... No. I'm assuming I gotta get some shrimp. Some shrimpy boys. Hmm. Wait, 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 wait. Can I do something with that gas? Hey. Man, I want shrimp tempura now. Oh my god, that sounds good. Let me see, what do I have here? Light bulb, empty bottle, sponge. Can I fill this with gas? I guess you want me to fill the bottle with this gas, Elio? That ought to do it. Oh wow, I can't believe that worked. Okay. There's some more gas over here. Oh, these are taller though, so. Let's see. I wonder what I use that gas on. I need some Kaede cosplay content, uh. Oh man, I've really been want oh, this one's different. I've really been wanting to cosplay a Danganronpa character, but I'm not sure which Danganronpa character I want to cosplay as. Like, I want to cosplay as Komaida, but also Chihiro. Um, but also Chiaki. There's also Makoto. I also really like Makoto. Like, man, there's so many, so many good options. You should. I will someday. <laughs> this pond sure looks different. Chiaki. Yeah, Chiaki would be fun. The water looks like jelly. It's formed a bubble over the surface of the pond. I want to do Gundam. Ooh, you should. I really like your, uh... <laughs> your spoiler chan a cosplay. <laughs> I really like your Mukuro cosplay. So, we're filling up the syringe, Elio? I guess it's kind of like a funnel. I think we all know who I'm gonna cosplay. Yes! Oh, Junko Anoshiba! I was gonna say Kokichi, but okay. <laughs> but the liquid might be a bit too thick to fit in the needle. Hey, it actually went in! Gross! <laughs> Let me see, what's it look like now? A filled syringe full of strange liquid from the swamp. Alrighty. Okay, so then, what do I do with that? Hmm. Can I? Can I combine these? I don't have his scarf. Aw. So I should inject the liquid through the cork, right, Elio? It's like I'm a doctor. A very adorable doctor. The adorablest doctor ever. Oh, I should probably shake this too. It changed color! My cosplay I'm focusing on right now is Emma Wood, Identity V. Ooh, that would be cute. So I got a bottle of acid now. Let's see. Thing is, we need voice actors, but since legit only one of us has Discord, we use Google Docs to talk. My email has my real name, so life sucks for the fan game. Well, if you want any voice actors, I am available, Gio. <laughs> but I understand that you are apprehensive about not having people see your name, so... It's understandable if you don't want me on it. <laughs> Is apprehensive the right word? I'm not actually sure. I'm trying to use smart words, but I'm not smart. I am functional. Was it you who fixed the generator? This is one cute robot. Well, Elio, 
Help me? Yeah, that's the right word. Mm, gotcha. But yeah. Hello, nice to meet you. I am robot number 310. Would you like me to take you somewhere? Uh, huh. Are you okay? I cannot move. Well, you're still really rusty. That is true. Hold on. Elia and I will find a way to help you. Can I use this? Need something I can use to wash the robot with. Oh, do I have to combine it with a sponge? I'm guessing you want me to pour this acid onto the sponge, Elio? I guess. Good thing I have these gloves. I hope this works. Okay, we got a wet sponge now. Oh my god, my stomach just growled really loud. <laughs> Alright, hold still. I have no other choice. All my cost plans have been taken over by Hello Charlotte. Understandable, Cactus. Man, I really want to cosplay Vincent so bad. I'm gonna do it someday. There. How's that? I can move again. Thank you. I am able to fill my purpose again. Where would you like to go? I want to do Henri and Charles so badly. I have ideas. Ooh, I look forward to it. You said that you were getting a Charles wig in the mail, right? I look forward to seeing it. Can you take me to the tower? Calculating. Closest destination to the tower is... The Glen. Port number. My built-in navigation circuits have fried. I'm gonna assume that's not good? It is not good at all. Once again, I cannot follow my programming. Aw. Is there anything I can do to help? In the event of an error, you should speak with the head engineer. She will know what to do. I got an Henri wig, but it's too long. So I'm either gonna cut it, have long hair Henri, or buy a new wig. Aw oh, man, I have like an Ukyo from Amnesia wig, and I've been thinking of styling it into an Ash Bradley wig, especially because I have a Chung San that's green. So I was thinking of doing like a casual Ash cosplay, but I can't for the life of me find where the heck I put my wig. I've also been thinking of cutting it and making it into a shin wig, but I I don't like cutting my wigs unless I have to, so <laughs> I'd probably just wind up buying a new wig. She will know what to do. Have you talked to the head engineer yet? She lives near the mine entrance. I would have given you the coordinates, but... Huh, okay. Where's... Where's Silver? I forget what area Silver is around. Wait, is he at... Is there like a war... Was it Lookout Point? I think it was Lookout Point. Yeah, hello. Hello there, baby. Hello there. Wanna go on a date? Wanna go on a date? Wanna go on a date? Excuse me again, miss. I found a robot who can take me towards the tower. It's having some trouble, so it told me to talk to you. Alright. What is the issue? I love you, Missy baby! It said something about its navigation circuits being fried. Just the navigation circuits. Apparently. Ellie and I fixed some... Ellie and I fixed everything else, so I think... Hmm. I have something that may help. Robots have the ability to trace material from their source locations. If you let the robot borrow this, then its backup tracking system should activate. Ooh, we got a CG. Nice. Cutie. That's a very pretty necklace. 
What's it made of? Amber found from the glen. What's the thing inside the amber? The black clover? That's a common plant in our world. It's also... Uh... Hmm? <sighs> I'm not sure if I can bear to part with this. My programming says yes, but I still feel conflicted. Huh? Never mind. You need to finish your mission more than I need a keepsake. Here. Oh, thank you! Okay, so I got... I got the amber. You have anything else to say? Want to go on a date with me? Before I go, is there anything I can do in return? Actually, I hope it's go on a date with you. Do you know how to play chess? I don't, but I'll do anything for you, baby. Yeah. Well, sort of. I played it with some older kids before. I played it like twice and I was a dumbass and failed miserably. Then, will you play a game with me? I mean, I don't know the rules very well. But I guess it's the least I could do. You're really good at this. Thank you. It was built into my code. Oh my god, we're going on a chess date. Yeah, baby! This is just what the doctor ordered. Uh, so, what's it like? Being a robot and all. I kind of know the rules of chess too, but I don't know how to, like, play good at it. <laughs> I've talked to other robots, and they all say something about programming and code and stuff. Like, you know that some pieces can only move diagonally or... Certain spaces, like, king and queen can only move forward, right? King and queen can't move back. Or maybe it was just queen, I don't remember. I've talked to other robots and they all say something about programming and code and stuff. Even you did just now. It's a little hard to understand sometimes. I know. Most of the robots here are not tamed. Tamed? Watch out. Here goes my bishop. Taming is complicated. Oh? How complicated exactly? Do I have to throw a Pokeball at you? Here goes my other bishop. I can't really explain what tamed robots are. But I'm one of them. All the other tamed robots have been moved to other regions. Exactly where? I don't know. Oh? Hmm. Here goes my little horse. Night. Right. Oh, have you ever been to any other regions? I heard that there's two more. In the past, yes. I still have the data, the coordinates, the memories. I don't know how much of that still holds true. The world may be a very different place now. Because the sun is gone? No. I said this already, didn't I? The sun probably won't save the world. The decaying started back when the sun went out. The sun's sudden death was just the tipping point, and things went south really fast after that. Oh. Then, there's nothing I can do? Check. What? When did your queen get there? The only thing you can do is complete your pilgrimage. Stay away from the summoner! In a way. You're only supposed to be a second chance for the people. Every time I hear pilgrimage, I just think of Final Fantasy. <laughs> just like how the Barons was only supposed to be a second chance for me. There's no guarantee that things will work out. But... Checkmate. Uh... Alright, guess I've kept you long enough. Thank you for listening. I hope you get home safely.
Uh, thank you also. Got anything else to say? That was a really nice date. I really enjoyed it. Will you, will you call me back for another one? Was I a good date mate? Off you go. There's no reason for you to linger in the barrens. Oh my god, did they just reject me? No. Okay. So, I think... Let's go to... Wait, no. Wait, I think it was the docks. Yeah, let's go to the docks. Okay, gotta find that bot bro. Where you at? Oh, there you are. Have you talked to the head engineer yet? Yes! She lives near the mine entrance. I would have given you the coordinates, but... Yes. Yes, I do have it. Oh, am I supposed to show them the amber? Uh... Oh! This is Amber from the Glen! I can remember now! Activating tracking system. Setting course. Wait. This boat is over capacity. There's only two people on it, though. You'll need to leave behind some... Um, oh. You'll need to leave behind some of your possessions. Oh. Well, I don't think I'll be needing this crowbar anymore. But you never know when you need a crowbar to attack someone, Nico. Or this gas mask and gloves. But but what if you go into a poisoned area, Nico? Did you just dump it into the ocean? At least, like, leave it on the dock or something so that someone else can use it. That is acceptable. Killed the robot and wrote it yourself. Profit. Yeah, then you don't have to get rid of anything. But I don't want to kill him. He's adorable, look at him. Aww. Cute CG. Baby. Baby. Look at Nico, Nico's so cute. I, I want Nico to be my pet. I would take care of him. Even if I don't take care of myself. Here's your stop, the Glen. Thank you. There should be a village to the north, but that's all I can recall. Oh, that's good to know. Farewell. May your mission be a success. Uh, are you leaving? Yes. I must return to my station. But you'll be all alone again. It's okay. I have not been tamed. Love yourself, bro. The horizon is glowing blue. Okay, so what is this? We got some water. What all... Okay, we don't have too much stuff with us now. What is this? Ooh. Pretty. I hope the particles aren't fucking with my bitrate. It's all I pray. Wait, no, I didn't mean to do that. Ooh. This is pretty. I saw someone running over there. Hi. Hello. Come come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. I'm catching fireflies for mommy. Oh, okay. You go then. The store is full of fireflies. Okay, we'll act well at least this place has like an understandable light source and not shrimp now. Alright, that's the way out. What if you don't catch them? <laughs> She's doing her best. Filled with small dried fish. I want some fish. I'm hungry. It's full of fish heads. These look like crab shells. He 
These are filled with small dried fish. I see someone over there, but let me go in here first. It's a bed. Well, more like a mattress. It's a fish stew. Oh my god, wait, this is making me so hungry. Warm coals. An empty jar. A jar of worms. Gross. There was a time where our people used to live in these ruins. But due to flooding, most of us have moved to less permanent settlements. Sorry, I got distracted. It's all good, Cactus. Flooding? Why? The land has gotten brittle. The glen used to be in one piece, you know? But now it's just a bunch of islands that get smaller and smaller. Oh! Nya nya! Nya nya nya! Nya 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 nya! Nya nya! Nya nya nya! Nya nya nya! Nya! There you go! There you go, Cactus! <laughs> uh. Let's see... Hello, who are you? A few small fish are in the bottom of this jar. Serotonin for only 1,000 points. <laughs> hmm. Nothing's biting. <laughs> Let me see. What's up here? Oh, that looks really long. Hold on. I'll, I'll come back to that later. It's probably where I need to go. Let me explore this area a bit more. See if I can reach any other people. Oh, wait. Got two long bridges. Alula? Who are you? Alula, where did you go? Elio, did you hear that? Alula. I think it's coming from the southeast of here. Was it? Which way is east again? <laughs> is it left or right? Hey, you there. Have you seen a little girl? She's a little bit shorter than you, and... Wait, that's the sun. Are you our savior? I... yeah? Oh, my stars. Sorry for my rudeness. Huh? It's alright. Are you looking for someone? My little sister. She's been gone for three days now. I've been looking all over, but... What does she look like? Um... A little shorter than you. Long blue hair. Two blue fla uh, two blue two blue feathers on top of her head. I'm sorry, I haven't seen anyone like that. Where was the last place you saw her? Back inside the ruins. She said she was headed toward the forest, so I'm waiting here now. I ran out of places to look. Aw, oh, well that sucks. Are you from the village? No. I don't remember why, but our father left the village while we were still young. We've lived in the ruins ever since. Well, it's just Alula and I now. I can't lose her too. Well. Got some lit up trees. Run around here. Where is your sister? We will find your sister. I promise you that. So here's a question why, while I am searching around, chat. So you guys asked me before, but what's your guys' favorite music? Let's say maybe like, you can tell me like your favorite genre or maybe some of your favorite songs? Hi. The 
This is the best fishing spot i found yet. I'm a bit of an edgelord. I am a bit of an edgelord myself, Yun. It's understandable. All the fish I catch here are longer than my arm. Mother Mother is good. I also like Mother Mother. Dare I even admit it's K-pop. That is completely valid, Goldie. <laughs> no matter what your guys' taste in music is, you guys are all valid. I know, what, what is that K-pop group? Uh, Super Junior? Does anyone know who's Super Junior? I listen to some of their songs because one of my friends is like a huge fan of Super Junior. I really like some of their songs, like Black Suits, I think is one of their songs' names. I really like it. Okay, look, K-pop and Vocaloid, that's it. Understandable, Vocaloid is like my main form of music that I listen to. <laughs> this jar is full of milk. Your cat, drink some. Not, not too much though. Milk makes you grow taller. That is a blatant lie. I've spent my entire life drinking copious amounts of milk and I am 4'7", Nico. What if my taste in music is Donald Duck singing Simple and Clean? That is valid, Jackie. <laughs> I love listening to that. Oh yeah, I know Super Junior. Nice. Yeah, I really like Black Suits. If you guys have the chance and you haven't heard Black Suits by Super Junior, one of my friends showed me it and I really like it. Okay, Mother Mother and Gorillas. that's it. Oh, Gorillas is also really good. Y'all are valid. That's her mama always says. There's only like one genre of music that I've never really cared that much about. And that's been country. A jar full of small rocks. Oh, we gotta hydrate. Thank you, Wonder XP. Oh. Let's see, I, I was thinking of some other group, but my, my brain just went and shut down on itself. Just a jar. Coals. Last week I saw more of these squares while out fishing. I knew better than to get close though. Squares? I can get into country, but I can never understand listening to heavy metal. Yeah, there's some country songs I like listening to, because my cousin has a lot of country songs. So when I'm in the car with them, sometimes we'll listen to country songs. There's like this one that sounds like a... What is it? I always made a joke. It was like turtles. Something about turtles. Some beach, somewhere. It was like a song like that. Squares? What if Lin's music taste is Hitoshi-san's cover of Hips Don't Lie? That is like the toppest tier. That is the toppest tier of music. I love that. I listen to Lin's Hitoshi's like... <laughs> Nyaneko Sugar Girls edit all the time. I like unironically like that cover. Duncan Rumpa Kin. Uh, let's see. Who do I kin in Duncan Rumpa? <laughs> Probably just Komaida. <laughs> just Komaida. I also really like Makoto, but I don't think I kin Makoto. I wish I was Makoto. That way I could date Kitty Kitty. Because I love Kitty Kitty. <laughs> Squares, man. They're bad news. No. Uh, tell me about those squares, man. Man, can't stand those squares. All four-sided. Kitty giddy Minecraft play among us and guess imposter rate. Daddy says the world is very sick, but Elio can make it better again. No, do not count on me for anything. Are you Elio? Um, not really. I'm just the messiah they sent. I can talk with Elio, though. Wow. What's that like? 
Really cool. Are you sure? I don't think I'm cool. See, if I were truly a god of this world, y'all would be fucking dead because I cannot take care of anything. Most of the green moss covering our village has already lost its glow. Don't... God, stop growling, stomach! If it weren't for the thin strip left on the boundaries of the land, people could easily fall into the ocean. Without light, land and water become indistinguishable here. Elio, you're really fucking cool. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, what, did, what is this? It's a bed. Elio is a man of culture. Everyone should strive to be like... No, do not strive to be like me, chat. Just a jar. You will be a failure at life if you become like me. <laughs> it's not ready yet, but would you like some stew? Yes, I'm starving. I'm not hungry, but thank you. I'm hungry. It's the least I can offer the savior. What? Stomach? Please stop growling. Please stop growling. I, I will feed you eventually. Wow! Is that the sun? Yeah! Well, time to order Popeyes for Elio. <laughs> oh, Jackie! <laughs> and you're holding it? Isn't it hot? I want to be like Elio when I grow up. <laughs> I never went to college, Goldie. I never got my etiquette. Well, I am in college right now, but it took a while for me to go to college. I don't have a job unless you count Twitch. I just stay in my room all day. Don't be like me. <laughs> Not really. It's nice and warm. Oh, bullshit. It's under maintenance right now. Aw. Well, that sucks. I will have some oatmeal later. Elio, your job is entertaining us. What do you mean? Am I doing a good job, chat? Am I entertaining you? I hope I am. That's all I've got. <laughs> That's all I got. Oh, this is full of heads of wheat. Do I have some sort of grain? It's look like flowers. The the oats, brother! Give me some of the oats, brother! This is it. The last of our grain surplus. Yes, you are. Aw, I'm glad. Bro, I'm just happy being in your company. Same here, Jackie. I always love hanging with you. And now we're dealing with a vermin problem. Oh my god, 94 sips. Please don't spam 100 sips, please, Joe. I don't want to die. Maybe you can get cats? Not that I'm a cat, I mean. Aren't you a cat, though? You look like one. Oh, can I enter from... No, you can't enter from the side. Okay. Don't drown him. He has so much to live for. Like maids. Exactly. Have I been in this house before? Yeah. And petting cats. Yes. I need to pet more cats. I need to go to that cat library and pet more cats. And simping. Yes. There's so many games I haven't played yet. So many girls and boys and non-binaries that I haven't fallen in love with. The land is fragmenting at an alarming rate. At an alarming rate. I don't like to think about the day when this town finally loses to the intruding sea. We'll have to find another place to settle. <laughs> that reminds me of a movie I like called Weathering with You. Haha. <laughs> Haha. You guys should watch it if you haven't. Yeah, it's a good movie. Yeah, Elio can't die before falling in love with me. Well, I already, f I already am in love with you, Goldie. Potassium gods are watching in displeasure. <laughs> the light from these lanterns will have to do for now. I'm starting to see some very small sprouts. It will probably take some time for these to bear fruit. Small sprouts. I gotta be careful I don't step on these. Is that a different sprout? No. 
Oh, they're all small sprouts. Gotcha. Jars of fireflies. Hello, goat. This ram is chewing on a ball of moss. Now I'm curious. What do you think they taste like, Elio? Oh, is this gonna turn out like Delta Rune? The moss, not the ram. Are, are you Chris, Nico? Are you gonna eat that moss? Get that mineral? Okay, I guess, I guess you guys aren't gonna move over. Why won't your dad let you eat your own food? What? What, Joe? Why? No, Elliot, that doesn't count. Our only date was robbing a fucking bank. <laughs> hey, it still counts. It still counts, Goldie. <laughs> The crops have been growing poorly without the sun, and there's no telling how long our surpluses will last. Please, Savior, you have to hurry. I... I'll do my best. What? I'm getting like a bunch of spam texts on my phone. We expect you to correct your billing details on Netflix now. I don't have a Netflix account. I have a Hulu account. That's all kin, Elio. <laughs> Why would you kin me? <laughs> Ooh, you look different. Are you Seer? Hello. Hmm, I need someone to help me herd my rams. Oh, I can do that. I've seen some grown-ups do it back home. You kind of just push them around. <laughs> Let's kin him. <laughs> y'all... <laughs> Are y'all fact-kinning me? <laughs> hmm, but... You are carrying the sun. Uh, wait, can't you just watch the sun for me? I cannot. I am but a simple shepherd. Son of a shepherd! Um, okay. Come back when your hands are free. You will be rewarded if you can herd my rams. Okay. What, why is this one spazzing out? Yeah. What? Yeah. What the hell? The hell? Okay, let's see. It's over here. It's that one person over there, but let me see what's over here first. Demon goat, right? Of a Satan. Doorway is full of vines, Elio. Let me see. Do I have anything? Well, maybe if you brought your crowbar with you, but no, you were like, oh, this this ain't useful. Let me just throw this in the ocean, Nico. It's a wagon stuffed with stuff. It sure is. Hey, ya. you here to trade? Trade? Yeah. Is there anything you want to get rid of? I already do, Ken Elio. <laughs> <laughs> Make me an offer and I'll give you something in return. Hmm. Do we have something like that, Elio? Uh. Huh, a strange journal, maybe? I don't know. Wait, trade this? Don't you want to find out what it says first, Elio? What's that, a book? Uh, not sure if I want to take books. I can't read. Oh, are you Jared19? You never learned how to read? Okay. I don't think you're gonna let me do that. I don't think it's right to trade this away, Elio. Oh, hey, you have one of those coin things. I've dug up a couple of these before. Yeah, there's this guy who would trade me the best things for them. Oh? Like, one time he brought me this little machine that plays music. I don't know what it's called, but you have to wind it up. Music box? That's it! I wish that guy would come back soon.
Oh my god, my stream stopped. Hold up. Why did my stream just drop like that? Okay. Start streaming. Hello? Hello? Hi. Stream? Stream? Are you okay? Are you okay, stream? I got spooked. I thought my internet went out. Yeah, that was really weird. That's like the first time my stream actually like straight up like died. That's weird. Like it, it's died before on your guys' end, but never on my end. So that was weird. Anyway. Empty glass bottles. Mostly empty glass bottles. Glass bottles filled, filled with different things. Bits of string, colored wool, plain wool, fabric scraps. A rusty bucket, scrap metal, shells, some rocks. What's all this for, by the way? I just think they're neat. That That's completely valid of you. Let me give you this light bulb. Elio, no. Well, damn. I, I knew that wasn't gonna work, but I wanted to see <laughs> how Nico would react <laughs> to me trying to trade away the sun. This, this is quite the bargain. Let's see. Have I got the thing for you, the sun? Praise the sun. These look like herrings. Or anchovies? Maybe sardines. I honestly have no clue. The flood can take away our farmlands. But it can't take away our fish. You tell them. You tell that asshole. Okay. Let's go in here. What's in here? A pair of shoes and some jewelry. Let, let's put it on. Some kind of cloak or shawl. Float folded neatly. It's an orb. The material looks like amber. That's my cousin's name. It's a staff. Reminds me of the one that robot from the Barons was holding. Is anyone gonna show up? This looks like an altar. Oh, can I put my light bulb here? Or maybe Amber? Or maybe Strange Journal? No, okay. None of those work. Yeah, it's back. Sorry about that. Okay, so I think I've explored most of this area. Let me... What's your favorite sauce? I didn't get to hear them answer. Honey mustard! I really like honey mustard. The crops have been growing poorly without the sun. There's no telling how long our surpluses will last. Please, Savior, you have to hurry. I... I'll do my best. Oh my god, stop growling, stomach. I'll, f I'll, I'll feed you some oatmeal once one shot is over with. Let me see. So is this the top part of the area? Yeah, this is the top part of the area. I don't really know what to do. Oh yeah, honey mustard is amazing. I'm, I'm glad that you agree, because some people in chat do not agree, and that, that is a crime. Worthy of being looked down upon at least a little bit. Okay. So, God, it's honey mustard again. Yes, I will never stop to remind you. It's not that I don't agree, it's just I never tried. Well, you should try sometime. Have it with some chicken nuggets. Alright. Hmm. Let me go back to the beginning of the area. Did I miss anything back here? Okay, no. This is just... a 
that's just a dead end. Okay. Hmm. Well then, what is your guys' favorite sauces? I'd say like ketchup is pretty good, like it's pretty multi-purpose, pretty non-offensive for the most part, unless you really hate tomatoes. Which, if you do hate tomatoes, that is completely understandable. Oh my god, stomach! Stomach! Please! I don't know if you guys can hear my stomach growling, but it is loud. I'm basic. It's ketchup. And with that, I dislike ketchup. Yeah, I hate tomatoes. I hate tomatoes, but like ketchup. Yeah, I'm, I'm cool with ketchup, but I'm not cool with tomatoes. Water sample collection in progress. Oh? Don't think I've been to this area. Dory's full of vines. Mine's probably honey mustard or buffalo sauce. Me, yeah. good choice. The sun, you're the messiah. Are you on your way to the tower? Mm-hmm. You can enter the refuge through this wall. You'll need to sign your name in the scroll first. All right, do you have a pen? Um. No, I have lost mine. Perhaps you should look around the glen for another. I'm going first. Have you found something to write with? Uh, no, I have not. Okay. Alrighty. Well, can't go in there. Can I go in here? Ah, baby. Hello, person! Mine is none. I don't like any sauces. I've tried. That's understandable, Joe. I tend to not like putting sauces on any of my stuff and just eating it plain. But if I do, I'll use, like, ketchup or honey mustard. Please do note that the ruins below are partially flooded. God, can we not talk about food? My stomach is growling. <laughs> I think that's why my stomach is growling. Oh! Should we not be here? There's no immediate danger. Okay, let's talk a fri fries. No, you're gonna make me starve to death, Joe. <laughs> Using this area as a dwelling is not recommended. However... Let's see. I like the music in this area. And there's some vines. Cluster of vines are blocking the way. We need to get like a lighter, like in Witch's Heart. Let's see. Ba 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 Do do do, walking around. La di da 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 da. Ba da 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 do, walking around. Oh, there's a computer. Hello again, Elio. Seems I need to help you again. Nico will not be able to progress otherwise. This time, the information you need has fallen to the most easily accessible place on your machine. Do you see it? Mm, no. Let me let me look. Let me look. Is it still document one shot? No. Let me look. Does it go to my desktop, maybe? God, go get it. Let me look. Let me look through my files. Here's my one shot folder. I don't see it. No. I know you're not exactly that bright of a for God, Elio, but that, <laughs> this shouldn't be difficult. Listen. Elio, take a look at your desktop, but not in the files. Oh. Let me see. 
Let me look. Let me see if I can. Oh! Holy shit, it changed my desktop! <laughs> I know you're not exactly that bright for a god, Elio, but this shouldn't be difficult. Hold on, let me let me show you guys my uh my desktop now. It's a fucking the the fucking PC calling me a dumbass. Thanks. Oh my god, stomach! Stop! Stop! Window capture... Window... Wow, why is it not picking up my windows? <laughs> okay. For some reason, OBS is acting up. <laughs> OBS, are you okay? Is it not letting me capture my desktop? Hold on. Window. Yeah, it's only letting me capture one shot for some reason. Let me see. Display capture? Maybe? Yeah, okay. I can do this. Here. Yeah. Here is the desktop that it got changed to. Also, ignore my cluttered desktop for a second. <laughs> yeah. All right, let's get back into this. I was confused that it said that basically you're dumb. God. I know you're not exactly that bright of a god. Just poke around a bit. It really isn't hard to miss. When shot is Monica, only lets you show yourself. Yeah, I already saw that. So hi. So I haven't figured it out. You remember the document, correct? This time, it's even more obvious. What's the most easily accessible place on your machine? Okay, what what do I use that for, though? I know what it looks like, but I don't know what to do with it. Are you gonna say anything else, computer? By the way, the effect is temporary. It'll be gone once you no longer need it. Okay. Well, I gotta figure out what I'd do that to then. One shot came out in like 2016, and when it first came out, when you closed the game window, Nico literally died. <laughs> God. I remember Joe telling me about that. It's crazy. I guess that's why they called it one shot. You had to do it in like one stream. You got a pop up on your PC saying you killed Nico if you quit the game. Oh man. These vines appeared mere minutes ago. Really? I've been seeing a lot of them in doorways and stuff. Freaked out when I saw it in the title screen. It was so different. <laughs> I just assumed it was because this place was abandoned. A sign of distress. Huh? A living being is in need of help. But I cannot trace the source. Ah. Uh. Okay. Hmm. I wonder where he used that at. Let me just get out of here for now. I think I explored. Wait, this is, yeah, this is a way out. No, there, there were the bed where it closed the game itself as Nico was sleeping. Oh, I see. So if I close the game now, would it still kill Nico? Let me see. Wait, have I been in here? 
Yeah, if you quit and try to start it again, the title screen has the light bulb shattered, Nico is missing, only the hat and cape appear in a lot of stuff. Hmm. No, I don't believe. Gotcha. No, it was removed now. Gotcha. I'm guessing it freaked out a bunch of people. <laughs> Welcome to the research station. Hello. Are you sent here by Dr. Silverpoint? No. Oh, carry on then. I swear to God, someone's kid played it and they got so scared that they had to delete it. I want to bet. No, it's more like people were near the, their, the end and their game crashed. Oh my God, that would suck so much. Hello, person. Welcome to the research station. Hello. Did Dr. Silverpoint send you? No, I'm with Elio. Oh, carry on then. Yeah, that would suck if like, your game crashed and then that killed <laughs> Nico. There are quite a few people complaining because of that. Ah, how come you're red instead of green? Well, more of a purple than red. But your eyes and stuff are red. I am only here to pick up this week's moss samples. I will return to my station in the city soon. I see. I am in charge of collecting the moss samples. Cool. Oh my god, stomach. Can you please shut up? God. Gotta eat. I've got like oatmeal. That's like all I got. Hello, person. I I, I hope there's still some like. I hope that there is still some pizza in the fridge. I hope no one ate that one pizza that was in there. Hello, person. This is the main generator of the Glen. Oh. Oh, and I actually fixed one of these earlier. In that place across the ocean. This generator does not need to be fixed right now. Right, you guys already have power and all. Couple of fireflies. Okay, so can I not go up to this one? Oh, I can. A generator. This one's got a working battery. Nice. Okay, so I came from that way. Let's go over here. Forest fruit trees are now being protected under the new laws. Please do not harvest them. I'm not. Forest fruit tree growth rate has been reduced as of late. I'm gonna keep forgetting that I can talk. It's all good, Cactus. If you don't want to talk, you don't have to talk. It's just fun having you here. Also, thank you for the hydrate. I kind of needed that. <laughs> My throat was starting to get dry. From all this talking. Talking, talking, talking. I'm like praying the pizza is in the fridge. I'm praying so hard. Beep boop. Water collection project resuming. Hello, living person. Hello. I have collected a duplicate water sample. Would you like it? Um, my programming says that organic beans need water to survive. Yeah, we gotta hydrate. So I shall offer it to you. Oh, uh, sure. We'll take it. Thank you. It's full of little glass tubes of water. Water samples. Let me see. Okay, so I can't use it there. Hmm. I wonder what I used that on. Monitoring anomaly. 
What is that thing? An anomaly. Well, yeah, but... Oh, nothing over there. Oh, thank you for the hydrate again. Let's have some more. Ah. All right. Thank you. Let's see. Is there anywhere else I haven't been around here? I believe not. So okay. Let's see. Let me see. I still haven't found that little sister person. I wonder where they're at. Well, I think I talked to you. Yeah. I did. Oh, hey. Hey. Ruler is all I have. Yeah, where the heck is your sister, man? This is one big area. You should go back to the place where the computer was and explore a bunch there. Oh, okay. I will head on back then. Do 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 do. It's down over here. Over here, and then you go down. Yeah, there we go. Alrighty. Which one was the maze? And this is the generator. It was the one next to the big robot. If I'm recalling correctly. Oh, does that take me there? No. How do I get there again? Do do do. Hmm. Let me just keep going down. No. Am I missing an area? That's like a big building considering how little is in there. Any bridges that I missed? Wait, have I talked to you? Oh yeah, you're monitoring the anomaly. That's right. Okay, maybe it's further to the right and then go down. Let me head on back. Hello guy, I'm back but not really. Welcome back, Hagu! I am trying to search for the entrance to where a computer was at. Go over here. Yeah, there we go. Here we go. Here's the area I'm supposed to be at. Okay. Just keep exploring this place. Okay, I can't move over there. I'm gonna go again soon because I got a birthday to attend to. And I might be watching when I'm there. Who 
Ooh, okay. Uh, it's for your friend's birthday, right? Wish them a happy birthday for me. Seated. Is this the room with... Okay, that just takes me back over here, I think. That's the room with the computer, right? Yeah. <laughs> Let me see. Let's go down here. Did I talk to you? I believe I have. Let me see. Found the source of the distress. <laughs> Why are you guys using the gun emote? <laughs> Are you threatening Hagu to say happy birthday? <laughs> Hello, person. Two children reside near here. Oh? Have I been here? This pathway is blocked by blocks! <laughs> e, I finally get to see my friend tomorrow. We're cosplaying together. She's like my only IRL friend, so... Ooh, nice! Have fun. I really want to cosplay with someone someday. Like, do like a little pair cosplay. I did it once with one of my friends as like Shintaro and Ene, but it's been years. And I'm no longer friends with that person, so. <laughs> Let me see. What's over here? Uh, Elio, yes, here. That Ninhagu to have a good time. <laughs> Savior? Oh my god, who is this? They look adorable. I can't believe it. You're real. We're doing Mukuro and Monokuma and going to Spirit of Halloween. Ooh, nice. Miss? Are you alright? No. We should get you to the village. Maybe they could... It's okay. It's okay. Too late for me. Elio, it's not the time to simp. She's dying. I will save her. And then she will be grateful. And then we will go on a date as a reward. But... The sun. I haven't seen it. I haven't felt it in so long. Here, I have the sun. Savior, if it's not too much trouble, could you lend me the sun for a while? I... Will it make you better? Elio, be white knight and I see... It's no better time to simp. Her last memories will be someone simping for them. <laughs> At least she dies loved. No, it will not save me. I just want to experience the sun one more time before I... Well... Oh... Would it... Would it be too selfish of me to ask? No, not at all, BB. Here. What should I do, Elio? Give her the sun. Here! I have almost forgotten. It's so warm. That's good, right? The, the vine should be gone now. I'm not afraid anymore. Don't say that. Saying I'm not afraid anymore is a death flag. I know you're dying, but yeah. Come on. I'm not afraid anymore. Thank you. Can I, like, give you a tube of water? You're like a plant, right? Damn. I want to save her. Okay. Okay, I can't go over here. So I guess this just made... It. Oh my god, I can't see. Do I have to take the thing away from her? It's the sun. I'm leaving it with her for now. Okay. Yeah, that, that's good. Very good. But now I can't see. So that... Okay, there we go. We can see again. It's so not all of the places cut off by vines are available. Sweet. Let's see. Okay, that one's still blocked off by blocks, though, of course. Because it wasn't blocked off by vines. It was blocked by blocks. Okay. 
Do you have anything new to say? The vines are seated. Also, you can do the sheep mini game, Elio. Oh, okay. Do you know what happened? I found this plant person. She was barely holding on. I gave her the sun for now, but... She said it was too late for her. Wow, that's very gay, Hagu. I understand. I need to report this to the city. Oh, shit. Okay, so that took me outside. Can enter some new buildings, though, right? Hi. How do I heard these, though? Is this blocked off? No. Okay, let me head back in there. Why is everyone's birthday in September? Mine's not in September. Mine's in January. Go back in. The superior month. <laughs> my ex, my friend, my other friend, Hagu's friends. Dang. Everyone's a Virgo. Virgos are good. I like most of the Virgos I've met. Yo, hey there, Yosa. How you been? Having a good day today? Oh, oh, there's a thing here. I can do, I can do the puzzle. Hold on. Gotta do the puzzle. Okay, so... Where do we start? Do... Do, do, and do that, and then should just be, get rid of this, and then that, and then we gotta do one more in the middle. Yeah! Got it! When are you giving me back my Goldie made desktop computer? Oh. Mine is on March too. Mine's in March. Ooh, we got a bunch of March birthday people here. March 27th, 24th here. Met like one person with the same birthday as me. Forgot it's your desktop. Yep, it is. It is, Goldie. You saved me. Thank you. I was trapped in there for so long. So, are you Alula? You knew my name? Hagu's birthday is March 2nd. Noted. Wow, the Messiah really does know everything. 24th. <laughs> Actually, I just met your brother earlier. Se second. <laughs> oh, right. Gosh, Calamus must be so worried. Can you bring me to him? Sure. Wait a minute. How did you know I was the, um, Messiah? I don't have the sun with me. Your eyes! Huh? Second. Sounds like tooth. <laughs> they reminded me of the sun. Oh. That's why you're our messiah, right? Well, I... A lot of people back in my home world have eyes like me. Goldie, please, say your birthday. I, I will do... I'll, I'll try and do something special for your birthday, Goldie. Home world? Yeah. Is it a world of cats? I'm actually from another world, you see. It's a place where the sun is in the sky and not in a tower. Do you like this world too? I... Yeah. Yay! Calamus keeps saying how this world is getting more dangerous by the minute. But that's okay. You're here now. 
You can make everything better. You have to have a birthday, Goldie. You exist. Yeah. What's in here? Okay, let's take you back to your brother then. Bold of you to assume that I exist, Elio. Y you exist in my heart and there on my back. You live on as a part of me, Goldie. So therefore you exist. All right, let's take you back to your bro. Should be at the entrance to the area. There you are. Calamus! Let me see. Wow, Elliot, that's gay. It is gay. Yeah, and nobody has killed you. Aw, oh, sorry about that, Haku. Calamus! Alula. You're okay. Thank goodness. I was trapped inside this room and it was really scary. But then the Messiah saved me. Oh, thank you for the hydrate. I am officially now out of green tea, so that is sad. My birthday is September 23rd. Oh, it's coming up! Oh my god. God, get ready. You were also born in September. Wow. Why is everyone's birthday September 23rd? <laughs> Glad to celebrate your birthday. Ten days. Wow. Wow. But then the Messiah saved me. Trapped? In the ruins? Yeah. There is the weird stuff in the door. Ten days, ten days. Gotta celebrate your birthday in ten days then, Goldie. You know, the floating squares we see next to the ocean sometime? The stuff you told me to stay away from? What? It's spread to the ruins now? This isn't good. Don't worry, I didn't touch it. You know whose birthday isn't on September 23rd? Ash Bradley. His birthday is on September 14th. Yes, it's tomorrow. I, I saw, I saw Is Drew Ash. I retweeted it on Twitter. It's so good. Also, Goldie did a good art for it. It's already the 14th for me. Happy birthday, Ash. Aw, oh, yeah. Don't worry, I didn't touch it. I'm not hurt or anything. Still, if it gets any worse, we might have to find somewhere else to live. What is this square stuff exactly? Bad. Anything that touches them just sort of gets messed up. So it's missing, though. Whenever you hear people say the world is decaying, that's what they meant. Him. Must pat. Very, a very good boy. I love he. Obviously, you should avoid them, too. I will. Anyway, uh... I can't thank you enough for rescuing my sister, Savior. Just call me Nico. Oh gosh, would it not be rude to call you by your name? Huh? Why would it be? I mean, I'm just a kid like you guys. <laughs> Must pat, big pat, gigantic pack, atomic pat. <laughs> Give him all the pats. Give him all the praise. Uh, then... Would you like to visit our house, Nico? Yes. Yay! Let's go! Do I finally have a friend? Oh, shoot. Looks like we can't get past that block. Seriously? <laughs> I'll be up ahead. I've literally never thought of that. Nico... You got the same brain cells as I do. You kind of get used to all the debris after living here for a while. Come on, our house isn't far from here. 
We're gonna have a little chat. Are we just gonna walk in silence? Okay. So, uh, welcome to our home. I know it's not much, but... Can y'all imagine there's people who don't know it's Ash's birthday today? Shaking my fucking head. Couldn't be me. You know, you know now, Hagu. Nico is the typical RPG pro tag. <laughs> also, oh my god. That, that image that Joe just posted of so Ash and <laughs> Komaida pointing at each other. Very good. Very, very good. So, uh, welcome to our home. I know it's not much, but feel free to make yourself comfortable. Ah, oh, there it is. Here, we want you to have this. Ooh, it's a glowing feather. It's not blue though, so I can't propose to someone. Oh, a feather. The edges are glowing yellow. It's a sacred feather from the Great Prophet. Oh? Yeah. She's this old lady our dad used to know. Her feathers can glow in the dark and she can see into the future. What? They gave you a quill. You now became Clyde. Oh my god, I'm gonna rewrite history. Wait, something like that. You can bring back all the dead people. She gave one of her feathers to father before she died. Father wanted to pass this down as their heirloom. Although... Feels more fitting for you to have it. Uh, are you sure? Totally sure! Then again, Nico is blue, so more like Lowen. Ooh, that, that is a good AU to think of. An Arya story one-shot AU. You only got one shot! Wonder if that's what father would have wanted. Thank you. Oh, by the way, what happened to the sun? I lent it to someone in the ruins. She said she wanted to feel the sun again before she. Oh, you must be talking about Mize. Is that her name? She's a powerful plant spirit. She used to protect the Glen. But once the sun died, her health rapidly deteriorated. Oh, I'm glad you were able to find her in time. I think we might already be too late to save her. I know. I'm glad she got to see the sun again. It's good to be home again. There's a clover symbol on the cover of this book. Hey, just like, oh, my book. Gosh, I still need to finish studying it. Oh? My friend gave it to me for Solstice Day. He's the one who wrote it, actually. He's also the one who taught me how to read. Oh! Wait, didn't you say you couldn't read before? You, you learned how to read while I was searching for your sister? I have a few more of his books somewhere. Can you perhaps... Can you perhaps read this? I hope the squares don't spread too fast. Oh, I guess he can't. Fireflies. Coals. They're cold now. Looks like spoiled food. Oh no. Is that what's happened if you leave your house for three days? Man, has your sister been missing for three days? Jeez. You've just been out searching for her? She'll probably eat something soon. I say to myself as my stomach is growling. <laughs> Jar's full of dried fish. It's a bed. Yeah, I'm getting close to taking a break to switch to Amayado, so I'll try and get something to eat then. It's a bed! Away for three days, the regular thing. It's a plush toy! That's mine! My friend gave it to me last year! Oh? Yeah, he has a fox too! And she can even talk! What? I know! I thought she was the coolest thing ever! She got... So he got me a f fox plush for Solstice Day! Oh, that's nice of him. 
Let me see. Let me see what Joe linked. Damn, bro, you got the whole squad laughing. Oh my god. So, Midori, Komaeda, Ash, Kokichi, and Joshua. Sad, dark stuff portrayed in a very unique way. Wow, cute. I don't know the purple-haired dude in the second pick, but I recognize everyone. I, I'm not talking about Sirius, by the way. The other purple-haired dude in, in the second pick. Generally cute, cool characters that make the plot even better. Wow, bad. Informant, so Ash, and... God, I forgot his name. Awesome, you want to understand it because you don't... Your legs when you can open the Bible. I only busted up for Jesus. If you think my room is a mess, you should see the rest of my life. Spoiler alert, it's also a mess with Russell. <laughs> Very good. Those are some ace memes. Oh, I'm sorry it's raining, Hagu. Hope you can take shelter someplace where you can't he hear it very well. He's the best! Jar full of worms. Jar's full of beans. Let me some beans. It's back here. Back room is full of dust and cobwebs. It's a fishing pole. Do you like to fish, Nico? I don't think I'll be able to go with my friend anymore because the front of the house is a literal river right now. Jesus! That's crazy. Yeah! So do we. They're good in stews. Or soups. God, stop talking about food. You're making me hungry. <laughs> I know some people back home who like to eat them raw. Ew! Yep. I'll eat them raw. I'll eat anything right now. Alright. I guess that is it for that. Elio, your motherfucking life ends in 48 minutes. Because that's when Popeyes opens. <laughs> well. Let's see. So that was it for that, I think. The... I guess I'll go herd the I'll, I'll go herd the sheep. I should be good as long as I focus on something else. Well, hopefully this helps you if you're listening to this haku. Let me see. Is this the exit? Yeah. Okay. Let's go and herd them sheep. Still don't know how to herd them, but I, I will figure it out some way. Oh, I see your hands are now free. Would you like to help me herd my rams? There's a great reward in store for you, I promise. Oh, uh, yeah. Excellent. To the south is a peninsula inhabited by my rams. They're all standing in unfortunate spots. You need to move them onto the darker moss. If you get stuck, ring a bell and they'll all return to their original positions. Good luck. All right. Move you over there. You over there got stomach? Can you please stop? Let me see. Let's move. Shit. How do I ring the bell? Oh, right here. Okay, let me see. I gotta get... You guys over here first. Or not. Hold on. Let's move you over here. I love these fucking sound effects. Okay, I think I think I should have it now. Move you over there.
You provided a great service for all of Ramkind. In return, take this fine Ram rule. Oh, uh, thanks. Nice. Heading to the city, aren't you? Been there, done that. Too cramped, you know? Guys, my house is stairs before you enter and the water is getting in. Oh, Jesus! God! How long has it been raining if you have all that water there? Ugh. I hope it doesn't get any further. Do you guys, like, have a... Like, a place to drain it at, maybe? I hope you're okay, Hagu. It's not like this place is getting any bigger with the rising waters and all. I'm raining for about 10 minutes and already all that. Wow. Hmm. Maybe the city isn't so bad after all. Alright, so I got the the wool. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Mm-hmm. <laughs> what do I do now? Hmm. Oh my god, stop. Stop. Stop growling. Stop growling. Luckily, we do have a lot of drains because floods are common here. My house layout is hard to explain. But because how it is laid out, water won't get inside no matter what. Both sides, it kind of goes down into our backyard. Oh. Huh. Let's see, what do I use all this on? It's long and slender feather with glowing edges. Okay. Me warp. Can I travel? Let's go here. Let me see if I can do anything. Here. Is it over here? I think maybe, maybe I gotta go and grab the thing back from Maze, maybe? Like maybe she's dead now? Hope she's not dead, cause I'd be simping for her though. All right, also, let me, Pull up something. So, chat. Do any of you play any instruments? I know that was asked of me before. What about you guys? Do you guys make music or anything? I used to play trumpet. Ooh, nice. I have one friend and they do some really cool vaporwave stuff really really nice if you ever feel like checking them out their name is usagi but they have the the u is like a hiragana character and they make some really good music oh have the lights gone out elio do you know what happened i play piano but i'm not good at all since i'm all self-taught well that's really cool that you got self-taught with the piano I wish I had the brain for that. <laughs> no. You really? But, but, oh, what am I gonna do? I once joined a class to play flute. I did not have a very nice teacher though, and she was not forgiving of the fact that I was struggling very hard on trying to play a note. Oh my God. Why are some teachers like that? Like. Be, do positive reinforcement for the kids. Like, come on. I used to play clarinet and violin, but now I do percussion. I like it more. Ooh, violin is actually my favorite instrument. I really like listening to violin music. I occasionally make music, but I never post it anywhere, especially the covers. Oh, God. I I'd love to hear them sometime, Goldie. Should share them if you ever feel comfortable enough. Like to play them. It lit up again? 
<sighs> She's gone. Oh. There's something on the ground here. By the way, the only class in my school I enjoy so far is advisory? What's advisory? It looks like a kennel of corn? I hope this isn't the, the fucking big titty corn man. She must have left it behind. Alrighty. Well then. It's like a homeroom except more learning about people instead of attendance. Huh. That's interesting. Alrighty. Huh, maybe I can trade the corn with that one person? From earlier? I got a bunch of stuff I can trade for now. The school system has both advanced a lot in recent years, but at the same time being freaking terrible. Don't know how they do it. Let's see. Where is the traitor? There, there you are. Hello. Um, I have some stuff for you. Let's see, I offered light bulb, amber, and strange journals. Let's offer the feather. I'm not trading that, Elio. You're not trading what? What's that, a feather? Mm-hmm. Oh, no, no. One of my covers of music are getting out ever. Aw. I like to hear them, Goldie. I'm sure they're great. I'm so tired, it's only six. Wow. Ye but ye, if you are tired, get some sleep. Wait, oh my stars. That is not a feather. That is a feather from the Lake Prophet. Probably one of the most sacred items there ever is. How in the world did you get a hold of that? Wait, I guess it would make sense for you to have one. You know, with you being the savior and all. Um, okay. Alright, how about this tube of water? How about this glass tube full of water I got from a robot? Do you like glass? Do I? Do you? I love glass. Yeah, I see all that glass there. Goldie, I bet your music is great, but if you don't want to share it, then that's fine. I won't force you. Same. I'm sure it's great, but yeah, if you don't feel comfortable, it's okay. So much. So much that I have too much glass and not enough other things. Gotta get rid of some of my old bottles and vials to make room for new stuff. Oh my god, you are a hoarder. That's why I set up a trade post in the first place. So I guess that's a no-go. Okay, how about the seed? The seed left behind by the plant lady? Oh, but what if it's like her baby? I can't give away someone's baby like that. Especially not to a bird. Hey! Hey! <laughs> ah, yes, because the bird would eat the seed. I think I have something I'd like to trade. You'll take wool, right? What can this wool get me? Wool, huh? That'll get you this fine vial of... I'm not sure what this is, actually. Some sort of fabric dye? Hmm. How about it, Elio? Hmm. Uh, should I take it? Hmm. Hmm. What, what else do you have? Eh. Wait, Elio, you wanna haggle? Really? Alright then. Elio said they wanted a better offer. Holy smokes. Yeah, I'm not gonna post it anywhere ever. If you ever make any new music covers, feel free to ask us to check it out. It's okay, Goldie. Just know you're braver than me. I can't even record me singing. Of course, wonky, if you wanna. Goldie, not wonky. <laughs> Damn you, I'd have correct. 
Man, you, you called your... You called the love of your life wonky? Add a sing option like Yen does. No, I, I, I'm too, I'm too shy. I'm too shy to add a sing option. I don't like singing. I don't think I'm a good singer. Holy smokes, forgot I was doing a trade with God for a second there. Okay, okay. In that case, I'll also throw in this commemorative t-shirt. Uh... Uh... I guess. Leisure doing business. Let's see. I got a novelty t-shirt. I herded rams and all I got was this lousy t-shirt. How come I didn't get that when I herded the goats and the rams? What? That's not fair. Deal, deal. Small vial filled with dark blue liquid used for dyeing wool. I can't combine those. Aw, okay. Let me see. Hmm. What do I do now with that lousy t-shirt? Do I give it to the herder? My rams clock at 133 megahertz. What? Is this supposed to be night margin? <laughs> I didn't mean to do that. Okay, you're not gonna take that? Alright. Huh. Mm -mm. Hmm. What do I do now? Hmm. I don't know. Maybe I can go back to the giant robot? Oh wait, I do have... I have a quill! I have a pen. I have an apple. I have a pen. Ooh. Stop growling, stomach! I have an apple. I have a pen. Wait, no. I have a pineapple. I have a pen. Ooh. Pineapple pen. I have pineapple. I have a pen. <laughs> no, hell yeah, no. Why? No, please stop. I, 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 see, this is why I don't have a sing option. See? See? No, Elia, no, no, no. <laughs> See? This is why we do not have the sing option. Keep going. No, I, I've traumatized Chad enough for one day. It's not singing, it's a song, but it's so cute. Keep going. <laughs> How do I get to the big robot again? I think it's to the right, right? Right, right? Right, right? Right, right? Right? Keep going or I'm going to five stack in regular identity V and realize two hours later I can't get in the game. <laughs> do keep going? Okay. I have pineapple. I have a pen. Boom. Pineapple pen. I have pineapple. I have a pen. Boom! Pineapple pen. Pa pineapple apple pen. Do 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 This song is traumatized, but your voice is great. Please keep going. Where the fuck is... Oh wait, it's from the fucking... It's from downwards, isn't it? Hey guys. Hey guys. Welcome to my stream. I'm a dumbass. Also, I think I'm gonna travel. Yeah, let's travel. Um... Is it the dock? Where's my bed? Is it over here? 
Yeah. I think I'm gonna end one shot for the night once I find that bed. I think it's near here, right? Wait, where is the bed? Where is the bed? Is it not here? Travel the gate? Is it in here? There we go. Yeah, let, let's go sleep. Let's go sleep. I'm a little tired from walking. Is that alright if I take a nap? Yeah. Alright. So that'll be it for one shot for today.